Thieves are targeting SUVs and trucks around the Kansas City area to make a quick buck. Sloan Heller is live at 20th and McGee in Kansas City to explain what they're after. Sloan, good morning. Good morning, Curtis. You know, every couple of months, catalytic converter thieves come out and they target SUVs and trucks all over Kansas City area. Uh, right now, they're kind of focusing on the plaza. We know of three so far just in one single parking lot at a uh, apartment complex, by the way, uh, on the plaza again. This right here, this is a catalytic converter. This was not stolen, but this was clogged, and so it's being replaced right now under this truck here, right here behind me. You can see the whole process and how it works. Uh, the reason that thieves target them is they can cut these things in just about 30 seconds. And then what they do is they sell them to recycling centers because they contain platinum and they end up making these recycling centers quite a bit of money. Now you can tell you have been hit because the minute you put your key in the ignition, it is going to sound like you're actually driving a boat rather than a car. Now, if you don't have a secured garage, a couple of things you consider. Uh, buying a cat clamp, it's called. You can buy it online. Or a cat lock. And you're going to want to talk to your mechanic first. Make sure they make some recommendations on which one they prefer. Uh, they're going to cost you about 100 bucks. Now, if thief sees one in your car, if they see one of these locks, they're likely going to move on to the next SUV because they just don't want to deal with the hassle. You're helpless. We're sitting ducks. Nothing we can do about it. And I called my mechanic and he said, let me check into some things. Supposedly there's some clamp you can put on there, which will be going on there after the replacement comes on. And that's all you can really do. Thank goodness I have insurance. Now a universal converter is gonna cost you anywhere from 250 to 500 bucks. A low emissions converter is going to cost you $500 and up. So again, check with your insurance. Hopefully you have full coverage and then you'll just be responsible for your deductible. We're live in Kansas City this morning. Sloan Heller, NBC Action News.